Hello, I'm David and you're watching Cruise Show UK. We're on board the brand new Norwegian Viva. In this video, we're gonna show you around our balcony cabin. It's on deck 11 forward, 11718. Let's go and take a look. Here we are, 11718. I really like this modern feature outside the door with these indicator lights. It shows you if you want your room made up or do not disturb. And it lets the cabin steward know if you're in the cabin or not. But let's go and take a look. Here we go. So the first thing that hits me is how bright and spacious this room is. But let's uh, start back here. On the right hand side you've got the electronic uh, room controls for the temperature, do not disturb and the makeup room. I really like that. On the left hand side you've got a lovely storage area, plenty of space and two good size wardrobes. Um, the uh, one thing I would say about storage is there aren't many drawers but I will show you more on that uh, as we go through the room. There's a full length uh, mirror, it is quite narrow and then on this side you've got four hooks for coats and jackets and then into the main lounge area you've got a quite a nice um, two-seater sofa which does convert into a bed. Opposite the sofa you've got a very nice vanity area. I really like this mirror unit with the lights uh, down the sides, really really nice. There's a mini fridge here and a good drawer. Some shelves telephone, there's two US power sockets and then in this mirror unit you've got some more power sockets. There's a European, a USB-A, a USB-C and a US power socket. Loads of power sockets in this room, you won't go short. Right. Further on into the room you'll notice this door, it's an interconnecting door to the next cabin. So if you're a family, I guess it would be ideal you could get uh, both of these cabins and then have this door open. Um, I will just say we haven't heard any noise from the cabin next door and there are people in there. So uh, if you're worried about that, you don't need to. Okay, the bed is very comfortable. I've slept in here for several nights now and had really good night's sleep. The pillow is excellent and the fabrics are really nice and soft nice and crisp. Either side of the bed you've got a nice uh, bedside counter. This one you've got two good sized drawers but that one is just a, uh, a static uh, unit and you've got two uh, lights either side with a USB-A power socket and USB-C but I really like it, very modern. Behind the bed you've got this feature wall, I really like it and it's illuminated at top and bottom. Looks very modern, it's a really nice touch. Opposite the bed you've got a good sized TV. I will just say it doesn't swivel, it doesn't pull out at all and you can get to the um, outlets on the back but I have a feeling they will be disabled. Um, don't be surprised if they are but you can reach them. There's plenty of storage underneath the bed, enough room for four good sized cases and I really like the curtains, they're nice and modern, very thick blackout curtains, great night's sleep. Here we are on the balcony. First of all, it, for a modern cruise ship, this is a really good sized balcony. It's quite deep and I really like these chairs. They're not the usual basic chair that you would get on a balcony. There's some thought gone into it and you've got a nice table, but it is really roomy out here. Lastly, let's go and have a look at this bathroom. Here we are. And like the rest of the cabin, I, I really don't have a bad word to say about this uh, bathroom. It's really big, it's light and airy, it's very modern. I love what they've done with the feature wall behind the mirror and the sink area is great. Good sized sink and lots of storage in here. It feels like there's more storage in here than there is in the cabin. Um, but it's, it's great, lots of space. I really like the sink area, it's really big. I love the mirror, the lighting in here is great. Uh, they've done a brilliant job. Let me show you the shower. First of all, glass door, so bonus points there, no shower curtain. But again, it's really big in here, plenty of space. 
Uh, I really like the shower head. Um, it's multifunction on so on the back. It's got it's got four buttons for different uh, style of jets. Um, nice products, body wash and shampoo and conditioner. Uh, it's a great, very clean, perfect. There we go. The only thing that that bathroom is missing is a night light. If it had a night light, it would have been perfect. But overall, this whole cabin is one of the best balcony rooms that we've stayed in in a very long time. Top marks. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this cabin. And please give this video a like, hit that subscribe button. And until next time, I'll see you up on deck.